Low pay, a tumultuous reorganization, and a nasty feud with the president is causing many NSA hackers and cyber spies to dust off their resumes. Reuters has learned of an uptick in cyber intelligence officers and government contractors looking to get out of the NSA, as well as the FBI and CIA, to go somewhere with more money and less drama, the private sector. Reuters cybersecurity correspondent Dustin Voltz. This has always been a concern for the government, retaining and recruiting top technical talent when they could, uh, when those hackers and cyber spies could find much more high paying jobs elsewhere. But uh, the combination of Trump's uh, acrimonious relationship with them on top of recent bureaucratic structural changes at the NSA has led to uh, even heightened uh, concern that, that people may leave in mass numbers. Uh, the thinking is that there's concerns about the way that he's going to handle the intelligence community and if he's going to believe their conclusions about Russia or other issues, or that he might try to overstep the bounds of his office and actually try to use their vast capabilities in some way to achieve political gain. Half a dozen cybersecurity firms told Reuters they had witnessed a noticeable increase in the number of current intelligence officials and contractors looking for jobs. Some NSA veterans attribute the morale issues and staff departures to the leadership style of Director Michael Rogers, who's overseen a reorganization of personnel and agencies that has left many feeling frustrated. This, according to many current and former officials, has also led to concerns about the uh, direction of the NSA, that they're not uh, achieving their mission as uh, adequately as they were before. At a congressional committee in January, Rogers saying that the presidential disparagement wasn't making things easier. I just don't want a situation where our workforce decides to walk, because I think that really is not a good place for us to be. A former NSA lawyer says such a rush to the exits would represent, quote, an incalculable loss to national security.